Okay, I'm Dr. Thayer. Uh, this is Keith, and we've been treating him since, what, November now. And he came in with several issues. Uh, the biggest one is one of his right, his right neck. He was suffering that with, for quite a while. I don't have the exact amount of time here. I'll let him talk in a second. I'm just going to kind of review some of this stuff. Uh, he also has a lot of arm, bicep pain, <clears throat> right forearm pain. Um, what else do we have? And those were the big things. He had a little heartburn. So I'm going to let Keith kind of tell us what's going on now. How's the neck? The neck is very stable. I'm really pleased with it. I got full mo motion. Um, the pain has disappeared, basically. Okay, you used to have a lot of it in the morning when you woke up. A lot of it in the morning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, the thing I want to kind of convey to you guys is that um, when you first came in, it wasn't something we took care of like that. No. It took a little time. So, Well, it took a long time to get bad, and it's going to take a a while to get better. Exactly. You know, I mean, I suffered with it for probably a year, and uh, now it's all, all but disappeared. Good, good, good. And so, uh, your right arm, you had some. Uh, both arms had pain, and the elbows out here. How's that going too? That's going very well. Strength has returned. I don't have to make as many adjustments in the work that I do. Yeah, he's a massage therapist or a rolfer, so he does a lot of deep tissues. Been doing it for a lot of years. And he had to make corrections in his treatment because why? Because the because of the pain. Because of the now, pain. Now I can get back to the way I used to work. My strength has returned. My energy is up quite a bit. You know, I can do my work and not feel all pooped out. So. The funny funny thing was is what does your friend say that you've gotten stronger and taller? Taller. <laughs> <laughs> and I needed to get taller. <laughs> they all say he's gotten taller. Anyways, we're going to let you show, I'm going to show you how I uh, adjust him, and uh, just watch. Okay? Uh, don't, don't sit down there. Okay, move forward, please. Okay, have a seat. Good. Now, what we do with him is we uh, started focusing on his atlas when we were working on him. And you need to move the camera down a little bit. There you go. And um, it wasn't working. So we had to recheck his x-rays and check how we were working on him. And we found, or I found, that this area, lower part of his neck, around C5, C6, seemed to be the culprit more than the atlas. And ever since we started working on that, we had much better success. Right? Correct. Good. <laughs> so I'm going to adjust you right here. Just let this thing fall over to the right here. Oh, you got your hearing aids in. Now I'm going to show you one other thing. When we stretch him, he's not going to like this, but this has improved greatly. He had no chance of stretching his arms before. <laughs> I'm going to let him see your face. Not my favorite. Yeah. Not his favorite. But he couldn't go past this before in the beginning. This was it. And so it's not going to be easy. We're just going to let it kind of come back. What we're doing is we're re-educating the spine, re-educating his muscles so that they become more normal. And a little bit of it is stretching through this pain. Okay. Good. Just oh. breathe through it. Good. And this is so much more normal than it was. I know it hurts. It hurts. It hurts, yep. But there was zero flexibility in the past. And he feels this where his arm was weak where it wasn't moving, and that scar tissue built up in there. So now we're breaking up the scar tissue so the, the muscles can work properly, and um, it's looking really good. Okay, on the table, please. So go ahead and come over here. Good. Up here. 
Now, I want you to kind of get lower with the camera over here. Can you see this curve in his back? Okay. That curve is a hyperkyphosis. And so this table really works out well because I can drop the table to create the proper motion so I can adjust it easier. So he really benefits from this table. One more adjustment here. Breathe in. Open the mouth. Good. So now we're going to adjust the atlas because it is a very important adjustment. Good. Beautiful. I went more than last time. Last time. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. On that one, come right over here, please. Okay, now we're going to do one more on him, which makes him grow. I'm joking to a certain extent, but he likes it because it makes him feel like he's growing. Okay. Keep the mouth closed, teeth together. He got probably two inches in that one. I'm going to five eight now. Five eight is on his way. <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay. Go and sit up. Okay. Last little thing. We're going to adjust his arms, and then we're done. Okay. So I adjust his elbows here. It's kind of shabby. Yeah, just do the best you can. Good. His wrists, fingers, all this is to create, again, space for the arms to work properly, take the scar tissue away. Okay, elbow. Good. Mm. And elbow, let it go. Good. Good. Okay, thank you very much for watching. Thank you.